Hello everybody, this is Sonia. Now, um, I'm just going to let you look at that for a minute because i just got to fix my fingernail. <laughs> I'm back. I've been <laughs> trying to, still in the process, but I'm back in my room. Look at me here. I'm back in my room. I have got a space on my table. I have got stuff around me everywhere here to use. I've also got a lot of... Um, stuff on the floor that I'm still going to put away but I could not stay away any longer because I'm just I've broke all my fingernails and it's really painful when they go and get broken right back there eh you know <laughs> so I'm just trying to fix this couple here because they're and I'm sorry about the but it's a shame I just can't put on some gloves I suppose so you can't see how bad this is but anyway if you just give me a second more now um, I do have a a giveaway that I'm going to be drawing in the next few days I have got um, a real lot of work to do in here yet but I will get it done I've started to collect up some bits and pieces for it so far you have to have your name on my video that says thank you for whoever you are or something somebody sent me some flowers if you put a comment on that video you'll be in the draw to win my giveaway okay for the month of March because it's going to be is it April today or, or tomorrow any minute now anyway it's going to be April I guess that'll have to do me I'll have to excuse the conditions of my fingernails as long as I don't get caught in anything now these are dollies because you know what Sonia's doing now she's going to do play around with making some dollies so you can craft with me today um, I, I was going to make a um, paper doll journal, but as as I was going along, <laughs> I actually got the, the book part put together. I may have showed you that. I don't know. Um, I'll just take these bits and pieces out of here that I've put in to look after them. I'll just put them in there so they'd be look after them. You should see how much paper I've got in here. I'm going to do some glue books too because everybody's doing glue books and I love glue books when I say everybody. A few ladies I've been watching their stuff. It's something that's been going on, you know, for a while. Everybody has a go at different, different things, uh, you know, from time to time. So, and this is one I'm going to use for um, my dolls. Okay. So I've just put a, a reinforced the spine with a piece of calico and the front of that and I was going to do one in the centre because I've got actually two signatures. Look at that. And plenty of room here to expand. So we don't really need to look at the that you know the bare bones of that because the majority of you will know how to put those together. Um I'm in the room I've got my sewing machine. I got me oh I can't really show you how much stuff I got piled around me. But it's so I can find it, you know. I've got my washi tape, my stapler, you know, buttons, inks, block, uh, <laughs> they're, they're um, actually, what does that say, uh, tools, you know, for punching things, me, me brushes, me, me everything, it's just around me, so it's really good, I have a, you know, I'm surrounded like this in the, on my table, I've got a great big table, big table, I suppose it is, because I can hardly reach across the other side of it. And then on the floor, I do have a bit more that I have to put away yet. But around about, I've got a pretty good, it's pretty good. I know where everything is sort of thing. I know you probably think that's really strange. Actually, there's one thing I can't find, and that's this blue, long blue um, toothpaste hold container thing that you put your toothbrush and your toothpaste in when you're travelling. And that I used to keep my um, card in from my 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 camera um can't find that <laughs> so because i found the card i tried to do a little camera case i've got, I've got a chain on it and i'm hanging it up here because I, I, I you know me i lose them all the time i lost it this morning but i found it again when i say lost it i suppose it's just you know you can't <laughs> remember what you did with it even though i did think i knew but anyway just the last bit of me coffee And you know what? It's cold here, people. Not cold, but I have socks on. Long trousers. 
I haven't got sleeves, I took off my jumper because I was getting a bit flustered and I couldn't find the thing. Okay, so this was just what we were looking at. Um, now I have a collection of papers and things that I have been working with because I was doing this out in the lounge room, as you know, when it's all been brought in here thanks to my daughter and a friend. Um, and they helped me, and but I'm, I'm in charge now of putting it all away. But the thing was, I started out to think, now, I'd love to do a paper doll book. The only thing with that was, I got real carried away and started finding things that, besides paper dolls, you know, that I want to do. When I say besides paper dolls, I'll show you what I've done. Now, I will do each one of these, I suppose, and then I can um, put them in there and there. So this is what we started out with. <laughs> she, she's going to be an art doll, but she's going to be an art doll with no actual, um, uh, when I say artwork, I'm not going to be using any sort of paints and things like that because I don't want to. So if you want to just come along with me and help me do this here this morning. So it's 5 to 11 and I can just work along and we just chat about stuff, I suppose. Now, I'm really pleased about all the people that's become my subbies. Now, this I got out of a, a music thing for her body. I, 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 I source all sorts of books. This one here is from a doll book. I paint, I coloured in a hat because I wanted it to be that colour. My poor Cameron doesn't know which face to focus on, I don't think. And then I put these funny little clothes on her. But I've been fussy cutting that. So for the, um, I'll show you what else I've been doing. This, is, this poor woman looks like she's been wrestling, doesn't she? I did have a dress on her and I'll probably fix that up for a bit later on and, and work with me and, and you'd see what, what we can come up with, okay? If you want to. Now I've got this one here. She's in serious need of some, see these are more art dolls than what they are, paper dolls, but we can... The book can have in it whatever I want to, can't it? Because there's not going to be any rules for me. I'm not having them. Now, um, this has got some nice legs and she's got no no arms yet. Uh, this lady was a, a paper doll and she has... I have got, I've got out some dresses. This one here is beautiful. Look at this, isn't she good? Oh, wow, well, that's fun. These, I love pictures. Pretty things. I suppose growing up we didn't see a lot of stuff like that. We had the Woman's Weekly maybe in the New Idea or some maybe a New Idea. Oh, I went the other day to the, <laughs> speaking of that, I went to the other day because I could never have too many um, you know, pieces of chopped up paper. This little fella, this little one's got a, I, I downloaded that, I printed off something, I thought. Um, anyway, so she's going to have that dress, so whether I'll put it on her well, next to her in the book, I don't know. So, um, what was I going to say? Yes, I went to buy some um, books the other day because I wanted to, you know, some new ideas and things like that. From the opportunity shops, on well, opportunity, I say opportunity because you get, you know, if you go there, you get, might get an opportunity. So that goes on there and you cut that out, that bit, but I don't think I want it on her, you know, because it's all just going to be changed up for me. Anyhow, back to the story didn't have any in any of the shops. So they threw them out. Nobody was buying the woman's weakness and things, so they chucked them out. So just for a bit of a look, I thought I'll have a look when I go to Bullworths just to see what I could find. <laughs> no way. $7. Scenes were $12. 19 for a magazine, for goodness sake. Any time I've seen a front out magazine from now on, I'm grabbing it. Okay? I'm <laughs> just letting you know that. I should probably not need to because I have got so much here that I've cut out already. But it's just the fun of doing it, isn't it? So there's more different ladies in this one. Can't see all this. We've got to all pull together because once there's too much stuff to look at, you can't get to look at the one thing. So let's just move these over here a minute. And I'm going to actually work on some of these today and finish them to put them in the books as different things, okay? Put them in my journal, whatever I'm going to be doing. So this part here is good because it's got a, it's a body bit. These are really nice, aren't they? They must have come out of a fashion magazine of some sort. I don't know which one it was though, but aren't they nice? Look at that. 
Oh, I could do a vintage sort of one. Look at this. But I'm it's so hard for me to stick to the one thing, I think. See something pretty good. Oh, I want to do that now. So they make good bodies. You know what we're going to make? Let's make one of them dolls that's arms and legs move, eh? That'll be fun to start with. And I should put some of these, I think, in a book. These must all come out of the same magazine, by what I'm looking at, I think. I wonder what that, oh, yeah, I remember that. It was one I bought up at the can assist thing, which is on again this weekend coming. I'm excited about that. Okay, so let's get this one here. Let's find some arms and legs. I must have a packet of things with arms and legs in it. Let me look. I'll just put, pop these back in here, I suppose, because otherwise I'm not going to... Right. It's really good to be back in my room. I can sit on my chair. My feet don't like me though. My legs, I mean, they get really sore after a while. And they actually go to the fact that they're numb. As I was sitting here in the last oh, four or five days, and I've actually got. Um, I wonder if I've got a bit. Look, see, I cut. I, I did them off the internet. Three some free downloady thing. Look at this this face, this is a nice face. Look at that, isn't that cool? I want one of those um some of this stuff I've had forever. Look an elephant one. You look at that he's got I'm, I made that a tag. That's in, in a tag now so I've got a lot of faces that I really like. Look at these. Aren't they beautiful? So whereabouts on it? so this is dollar eye part Doll faces, eyes, and parts. Right, oh, where's the parts? I've got. I want to make it ones that. I've cut them out on my skin and cut them all day. Because you can do that. <laughs> cut them out, someone. I've got my skin and cut set up in the other room so I can just go in and use that when I need to. Talk about spoiled. I am so spoiled. My husband looks after me so well because. I like to do a bit more. Now that it's not so hot, too, I've been doing a bit more. I wonder what I did with them little things. I set them, you know how you think I just set them somewhere and I'll find them any minute now. Let me see. They're in a packet. There's some of those here. I don't know if they're in that. I don't think they are. Look at this. This is where a person was um, making that out of clay. That face. I've got it out of a book. So I don't need the ruler in here. Not as yet. Okay. Well I've got doors. I've got doors and I want to make a cupboard. Look at that. This was in a doll old doll or well, some sort of a doll book that I was gifted. And we don't want the flowers in there. We don't want things that's going to take up too much space, do we? I'm sure they're in here in a little packet. Just let me have a look. A quick look about. I've got all these Tim Holtz ones here that I bought. They're black and white. I'm not a big fan, but I'll fix put them in something. I like, um, is that a leg? There's a leg, but I needed a packet there. I actually cut out little bodies with arms and legs, little bend and things. Looks like I'm going to have to do it myself, doesn't it? Looks like it. And look like I've got what I'm after. Okay, there's two legs there. I don't get those. And oh, there's more boxes over there. <laughs> okay, not going to run out, Sonia, are you? Nope. Let me see. Well, oh, I think there's mostly birds in this one. Oh, could it be in here? It's a little bag. I'm going to put it in the end of the box. I think there's a nice little birds, because I was going to do... I'm going to do things with wings. Things with wings. Well, there's cats too, but, you know. There's a little packet. If anybody sees it, just, you know. <laughs> you can't do that, can you? Yell at me. So, sorry, you missed it. Oh, dear, oh, dear. Oh, I should be making so much stuff. I've got all these things I've collected up here, but 
I've been limited by what, how much time I've got to to do them when I've been working in here. Out there, I should say. Now I can spend at least four hours a day in here, I think. Oh, really, Sonia? I don't have time just to duck up to the rail and cut out some more, so I'm not happy about that. So I wanted to do this. I'm going to have to just do it with whatever I can find, don't I? Make it myself. That's going to look good. Might might do too. You never know. So let's go on to that then. Let's go to that. We need some body bits, okay? Um, there's a, another leg. Nice things in there. Some people sent me too. Their eyes are a bit scary. I don't want to them on that yet. Oh, here, look at this. There it is. Knew it was here somewhere. It was only small. And I didn't realise, you know, until I meant to cut it out, how small it was. So let's put these back here. I just wanted to do it out of this because it is cardboard and cardstock. And I'm going to. Um, I'll have to stick other ones onto the cardstock, you know, eventually, too, to do it with. I will. Right, now, I've got some tiny, 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 tiny little, um, brads I'm going to use. I know this is going to be a small thing to watch, but we'll see how we go. <laughs> when I cut it out, I did not realise how small it was. Look at this. Actually, my scan and cut played up when I was trying to do these leaves. Now, I hope I've got bits for the whole body, this part here. I've got to get some really good paper, you know. This paper that I got, as I did this with this cardstock, didn't work very good. I was very disappointed. And I, Jeremy said I should get another, what's the name, and I will. Another needle, not a needle, blade. The blade is so small, you'd wonder it could do anything. It's... The tiniest, tiniest thing you've ever seen that does this. And people say to me, can you cut out your things, your pictures? Why don't you cut your pictures out with your scan and cut? Well, I'll tell you. Let me see if I've got a, something I can show you for an example. Because when I got it, I thought, oh, good, I'll be able to fussy cut all these little things on, on these pieces of paper, you know, because these are graphic 45 things. The scan and cut will cut every line that is dark, okay? Won't just go around and cut out what you want to do. <laughs> Maybe there's a thing there that I haven't discovered yet that I can... Uh, um, but you get the slightest blemish on anything or a darker line than the rest of them or whatever and it'll cut it out. It's thorough, <laughs> but it then you don't you're not very pleased then with your outcome, are you? Because it just doesn't it doesn't work for me. Like I can't. Well, I haven't figured it out really that good, so I'm not going to say it's completely hopeless with doing that. Because, but I just wanted it anyway for for doing shapes and things for myself for the start with. Now I need to find the right things. I've got some nice little leaves here. I want to put. Put aside, I don't know how they come to be in this packet. And anyway, I need to get things that will go to the same size. I oh, can't make a. Do you think that's about the size for that one? I might not. I hope I can get a full thing. It'd be good if I get one of these bigger ones. We'll be able to see what we're doing, won't we? Okay. Leg. I think this is actually the top of the leg. You're going to be a bit tall that way. Yeah, I think so. Actually, it's probably bigger than I thought it was. Well, we'll try and see if we can get the white one on this here side now. Maybe. It's, it's a, there's a bit of a leg for that one. Because I know that a couple of them just didn't cut out really good. That's what the thing was with this too, which is very disappointing. Why hasn't this one got a head on it? Probably chopped it off, did I? wonder why that hasn't got a head. This one here has. Let me see. Right, so we've got this much of this one. Let's we see if we've got arms. Is that a leg or an arm bit? I don't know. <laughs> What's the arm bits look like, Sonia? Here we go. Is that bit there? 
Isn't that big there? Is that an arm? Maybe not. You reckon? Oh, we need another one of those. We're right. That bit there. Probably the wrong arm. Is it arm here? Is it arm? No. Is it an arm? No, there's a leg. Come on, there must be another piece here. Sorry for about the fiddling bit, Mandy. I'm sorry about that. Isn't it? Oh, there's one. Look at that. Probably everybody was saying there it is. Look, 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 look. There we go. Look. How's that? We got it. We'll do that one because it's, we're going to be able to see it, I hope. Mind you, I don't know what we're going to do with it after, but we're going to put it together. I hope we're going to put it together. So if you can cut out your things to that far anyway, like you can buy, you can, if you can't download something, just go and get them out of a magazine. I'll try and show you how to make one out of a magazine in a minute. Now I want to get a little, a little punch thing to make a little hole. And I've got two here and I want one's got a big, I don't want to make a big hole. That one is. This is small one. Might have to test it on something. Be a good idea. See how big the hole is. Do you reckon that's too big? Won't tear it, will it? So you need to check these things because you don't want to. No, that's all right. You don't want to tear it, do you? Okay. So that was the one I got, wasn't it? Okay, yes. Now, no, this one disappears through, I don't think. So, well, so after, I can either put some clothes on it or just leave it like it is, can't I? Because it just, gee, that just, just fits without falling through the hole, doesn't it? Yeah. And it's good to try these things first because you want to know what's going to happen. It'll stay there, will it? No. There we go. Okay. Because nothing worse than getting to the end of something that's not all fixed. These aren't going the right way. Well, that one's got it's back to front sort of thing because it was only one I could find there, I think. When I say back to front, it's not made out of the same. Hang on. It's been cut out from a different side. That's not the same length. Well, see, that'd probably be good to have fun with an art doll and that, I suppose. But my poor old hands are falling apart here. We must do something about that. We use our hands all the time, don't we? And I'm always washing them and wiping them or drying them or something. So, anyway, so we're going to go along and we're going to make some little holes where we think we'll do the arm here first. I can't see a thing, but what I'm, I'm going to put this. Make sure you put it in the centre as best you can and bring it. Ah, come on, I'm, I, put, I put it in the wrong place. I didn't know that there was a. I think, I don't think I did, did I? We need a hole in the end of this one. Here. Is that supposed to go in there? No, it's not. I don't think. It doesn't matter where the hole is because you're going to fix it together probably in a minute. Okay. Now, where's that bit? Here we go. I'm going to put that there. Is that going to get stuck on there every time? Really? I do have a little tiny punch, but I think the hole's too big in this one. Yeah, that's way too big. Well, I might have to just be patient, I guess. Don't know about you people, if you can be patient with me or not. So these have got to have a hole in both ends. And if I could fast forward that. My daughter showed me how to pause it the other day, but you know what? Uh, it's too technical. It's just not one pause button. You got, you got to... It's too tricky to, for me. I can't... I'm afraid I can't deal with it. You've got to pause it and then unpause it and... Uh, it should be a different button and turn it on and that. That's what I think anyway. Probably should do this before I put to the video on, but you can just sit there and watch me as good crafting with people. I don't mind it. 
don't mind at all. Oh, by the way, my my um because I have subbies all over the world, there's no way in the world that I would have a giveaway and not give it to internationals. I know it costs a bit of money, but um we all have Etsy shops, we all have things that we sell and stuff, so I think, you know, it's only fair if you've got people that subscribe to you all over the world, you should, anyway, so that's what I always, never would I eliminate the overseas people, it's not me, I know people, some people can't afford to, because they... Oops, did I make that too low? Probably. We're going to find out, aren't we? Anyway, you re I reckon I can patch it. You know, like, I'll show you that if I need to. Yeah, so I mean, giveaways for everybody, please. I mean, I know that it costs a, a bit of money, but if it wasn't for you people, I would not have my channel. I would not have my Etsy store. And that's just how it is. And I really appreciate everybody that watches my channel and, and, and all the lovely comments that you leave for me. I really appreciate it. So I know I can't I can't give everybody something because I'd be forever trying to do that, but I'm going to do the best I can. Okay, so now we've got holes in everybody, aren't we? So we've done that. Let me see what time it is. It's been 20 minutes fiddling around so far. It's okay, isn't it? Do we want colours? Do we want colours on there or are we just going to do white? <laughs> Don't make these decisions on you, just do it. Let's just do the white ones, okay? Now, I want to put... Do you think the leg goes like that? <laughs> I think maybe that side. Maybe that side, I think. Yeah, okay. So we put that through there. Oops. And fall out. Or you could, you could use... Um, you know, you can use anything, any size you want to. I don't know where I got these from. Look at that. Isn't that cool? Oh, dear. If this is worth it doing. This is worth it to do the fun of making this. I'm going to have some fun. I do love making little bits and pieces. I do love making heaps of stuff. But I, I'm really, really loving this because all, as back far as I can remember, I've always wanted to do with paper and writing and you know things like that i really enjoyed anything like that this one will go on this side of her body do you think <laughs> very good all my fat arm is in the video sorry about that i'm leaning on them that makes them look worse but they are what could i do it's no good trying to disguise them they're there that's me Okay, another one. Oh, look at this. Isn't this good? I'm not for, and here's me thinking it's only going to be small. It will fit in my book somewhere. Because it's going to be a paper doll. And I'll find her some clothes. Whether I'll put them on or not, I don't know. Because I'll do a junk journal or something with her. That'll look good. Yeah, because both the legs are going the same way, aren't they? So that's handy. <laughs> I suppose these things will move about a little bit, but that's okay. I wonder if I can press it down a bit more. My hands are not very strong these days. Uh, we don't want to look back look backwards, we need to look forward, no matter whether they're I might have to press it down with the pliers just a little bit, eh? Do you think? Let's give them a little sque squeeze down. It so says you're not too wobbly. I wanted to move, but I don't want it to be. How's that look? <laughs> that cool. I'm having fun here, aren't you? <laughs> okay, now we just want to hope that we've got arms. But see, that's not bad. Is it? Are they, are they too small? No, I don't think so. It's not an orangutan. <clears throat> what do you know? That goes there, and that goes there with that. Well isn't this fun? Now I'm going to have to show you how to make one yourselves, aren't I? Because I don't want to, for those people who can't cut these out <clears throat> I think I might have this 
this part of the arm going that way and this part going like that what do you reckon? that right? oops I think I've got it upside down have I? okay put that through there on um, AliExpress you might be able to get these little pressing things you know the <laughs> they're called um, brads <laughs> you can probably get brads off AliExpress hang on now I've got to make sure this is going the right the tech the thing on it won't be the same because that's the back side of the um, paper but that's okay nobody panic because it'll be fine it's your dolly and you can make it any way you want to okay can't get this apart we've got our fingernails you know they come in handy they really do shocking when you haven't got any <coughs> they're all breaking on you but I don't know how these ladies have all these nice long fingernails and craft okay. <laughs> they're very very careful obviously I'm not I'm not I'm not very careful now the thumb's supposed to be on the inside you know there so we're going to make sure our hands on properly they're right that's, is it going to be right because I'll put the other one on the other way I oh, know they put it like that yep it'll be fine should probably have a a sleeve on or something in a clothes or something I don't know or she could just be a tag or something like that okay that one and one more and we've got ourselves a moving doll now I'm going to make one look at that her arm's gone and slipped off her shoulder and she's poor little thing maybe if I just move it in the one direction maybe I think I'll put that on now haven't I and then I squeezed it down with the thing should be up higher shouldn't it should be up here we'll fix that later we'll fix that later but there's these go there's a little moving lady so I don't so um, let's put that in a bag so we're not going to make it a mess or get it lost is what we're going to be doing if I'll go and cut out some more later so I can um let's see if I can get some done before the giveaway it just depends because I've got to find I've got a bit of stuff so far. I've got a bit of stuff. I just don't know whether I'll get a chance to cut out more because I've got to get I've got to get a bit better paper. I've got some nice coloured card, but I wanted I want a bit better a bit of paper to do that with. I'm gonna put some of these back in. I'll put them all back in to like find the pieces for the for the body that we're going to make out of a magazine or something. Okay we can use now if you want to get um, a picture you should always look at me glass because sometimes I'm probably about to swallow a piece of paper um so in here did I have any legs in here you need to find something that some pieces of people okay some bits of people and it's really not that easy to get the pieces here like you know for their for their arms Wait a minute. that's not that is not one of the bags that I've got them bits here hang on a second I do want legs for this so I'm going to just leave this one out I think because I'll do some legs on her I find them. That's the, that's the trouble. You see, you've got to have, you've got to find the right um, pair of pants or leg or whatever. 
these got good leaks. They're the ones that you can get off the internet. But a lot of people don't have a printer either, you know, so if you haven't got a printer to print them out, it's a bit difficult, isn't it? Okay, so I'm going to use one of these faces or one of these heads. I might use that head there, it's got a neck on it. Okay. And, well, look, she might have, um, she might be different legs. She might be a bit skew whiff, but you know what? It doesn't matter, does it? It doesn't matter if she's a bit skew whiff. I might take the legs off that lady. And some of these ones. But they're ones that you can copy, so we need something, we need to make something and we're not going to be... And one of them arms is good. I don't know about the other one, though. The armless. And now I've cut these ones out of... Um, here's a body bit. Out of things that I printed off ages ago. Because I've been doing this doll collecting thing for a really long time. Because um, I really enjoy doing this. And... Okay. What do I need now? Arms and things, do I? What's that? That's a cat. That's not very good. It's no good. For the day. There's a foot and a leg. Let's just see what we can do with these bits here first. Before we go any further. I've got a body. This poor little lady, she's going to lose her feet and arms because I'm going to... Well, this is cheating too, but you know what? It's coming out of her magazine. I just wanted her arms over, really, didn't I? Because I've got legs. Let me get that arms. Some legs there. Maybe they'll go on that one. I don't know. That makes her extremely long. Well, I might leave her at that length, I think. Okay, so we've got, uh, we need arms. So here we're going to need these arms. These are not jointed them yet, but we can make them like that, can't we? I think. I don't know. Let's have a go anyway. She's only got a short arm because she's only a short person. There we go. There's one. Now, I haven't done this before, <laughs> and that's okay, because I do love to try something different. I do. I'm going to keep that hand like that for the time being, because while you're doing things with something, you have to be careful that you're not going to wreck it. Okay? Now... <clears throat> Where's the other one? Here. Two arms. Okay. Now, get the body. Are these too long? Nope. That'll be good. Thank you. That'll be really good. And I'll well, put the little jean legs on her. I don't know, Where's, which head am I going to use? I was going to use that big one. Mm, that makes her a bit... a bit large, doesn't it? I'll work on the head in a minute. Right. Now, the arms are cut off really... Um, I'm going to stick them onto there. And cut them out again, okay? Because we will need them to be um, the right shape. Like they need to have a bit of a shoulderish sort of thing. <laughs> like, see where I cut the clothes off? I probably should have left that there, but I'm going to draw around here a bit. Because we want something that's going to come on and going to have where we're going to put the the hole, okay? So we need that bit there, don't we? 
So let's glue that onto there. This is going to be hard with this. Where's the small one? Oh, can't see it at the moment. I never can get this right which part of this comes off. I've got it. Now I'm going to glue the arm onto the paper and then I'm going to cut it out again with this end bit on it. Okay, now let's move it over a bit. Move it down. So she's got a, a shape to her arm. And this way, it's up to you whether you can get the, your shape like that out of the whatever you're cutting out. But I'm just thinking when I'm to do this, I need to have that bit there, don't I? See? You need that bit there so it looks like it's um, going to be able to move when you put it on there. Okay? And this is still a bit sticky and a bit wet yet, so I'm going to. And there you go, you've got a bit of a, it's a proper arm, okay? <laughs> when it's a proper arm, it, you know, it's like going to be all right to, to work with. These ones here are stiff and straight too, but I guess that doesn't matter. Although I would like to join them. I could do that by making them just a bit shorter, couldn't I? We don't have to be too, too um, I'm going to round this off a tiny bit. I'm going to chop it off at the knees. I'm going to round that off a tiny bit, like so. I'm making them sort of look like the one I just did, aren't I? Round that off there like so. I don't know if I'm going to keep the shoes on there, if I can see sort of shoes, I can. I wonder if this is going to look properly when I do it. It will. And probably, if I wasn't wanting to get this done so you can see it today. See, so I could have cut that out of any sort of leg. There's a leg there. These are actually on a doll leg, but you can cut them out of any sort of thing. Just chop them off at the knee. And you can just make them to look like the other dollies. You know, the ones that like this that we did so they're jointed. You don't have to have the machine thing to do it with. These well the body bit you can use that too as a this person here, she's got a bit of a shape to her. So a little bit hefty. Well <laughs> nothing wrong with that. She's probably a little bit bigger than what the other girl is were, but we'll put this up there anyway. We'll cut this out and we can use it as a shape try and shape it into what, what I think it would look like anyway I don't know and it's black but you can change the colour or the person on the back around there like that around there like so Now, <clears throat> and we're going to join the, join the arms as well. So I'm going to just round them off so they don't look too weird. <laughs> Not too weird today. I'm going to stick this one onto something first, and I to give it a bit of the edge bit. I could put it on there. A little piece of paper somewhere that work. Here we go. Come on. I'm going to stick this onto here. And it doesn't matter, see, because the base of this is fine. You can just paint it, put clothes on it, or whatever you want to do. I'm doing this now, but then I'm going to draw the bit in. sure when I cut it that I get it right. I hope I haven't got my head over here. Sorry, I hope you can see this, what I'm doing. Okay, so now when you cut it out, she's going to have that bit there that I just cut off. 
Oh well, you know, because that was the clothes that she had on was in that part. Yeah, I want to make sure that my I don't know if I've got my legs the right look the same length, but where the where the joint is and the knee, I just cut it. <laughs> I wasn't paying attention, was I? But it doesn't really matter. It's not that big a deal, I don't think. Just lost that bit of arm there. <clears throat> suppose we do like ourselves to be level. <laughs> I don't know. I've got one foot, one size bigger than the other foot. That's not good. <laughs> oh dear. <laughs> Never mind, I didn't know that. I used to always have trouble finding shoes to fit me. Then I went to one of those places where they do your, you know, you stand on it and, they, and I've got a foot, one size bigger than one, one size bigger than the other one. And what else? There was something else wrong with it. I don't know. Mother made me deformed. <laughs> Not nice on you. You've been silly today. Okay, so let's make holes. And put this young lady together. I hope. Nobody panic. We'll just do the best we can. Okay. And one here. And one here, and one here, I'll make this, go, make this a bit of a turn around, there, it wasn't real grand but it looks okay, I might have been doing this before wrong, I don't know. Come off there, and be good at. It would be better, and I may do this. I don't know. I'll take the things out. Take this little. Um, okay, what have I done? Oh, good. Thought I did something wrong to arm. I'm going to take the um, reds out, and. I don't want to tear it really. I don't know, I must be putting it in the wrong place while well, it's doing this. It's getting caught. Uh, I'll take the brads out and put it onto some cardboard, maybe, after just to. Is it supposed to be under that spring or not? I, I, I did work out how to use it before and now I've just. Now it's just avoiding me because I'm in a hurry. I want to show you how to do this. Okay. This one here. I haven't. I, I haven't. I don't think it goes in there. We'll give it a go. And see. Ah, oh, yeah. Look at that. Comes off. Sonia, you've been fiddling with this for all this time, mucking it up. Oh, that still got caught. Oh, no, I didn't. That's a bit sideways, that one. <coughs> Haven't quite punched enough holes yet. <laughs> You're not going to appreciate where I'm putting these ones, but I can't help that. It's just the way that the thing is made. That way. In there. Right, have I got everything? No. Nope. Got to do another leg. Why did you get it on there? Make sure that you do get it on there, that you haven't, your hole doesn't come across the thing and tear. Oh, come on. I don't think I've got anything interesting to tell us. I, um, got to make a hole in this one. Only the fact that I've been tidying this room up. I found some really good stuff. Well, I knew I had it. It's just, you know, you don't know where it is, do you? If you've got so much, to too much stuff. Right -o. Now, let's put some little brads on this one. I might even use the pink ones just for fun. Now, this is a hip part. So, we need this part here. Which is coming over the side a bit, but you know, that doesn't matter either. I'm not going to be picky about it. And if I have to, I will trim that leg back down a bit further. 
okay but it's going to be fun just to have you know the doll in the first place isn't it yes that leg's way out there too far <laughs> oh dear this one's not too bad she's supposed to have her legs closer together Sonia okay Maybe I should have measured that first. Well, because we're going to cover this, <coughs> excuse me, because we're going to cover this with um, something. Oh dear, I'm going to have to go now and come back and show you what I've done when I finished it. We're going to have to put this down here a bit, I think. Her, her, her legs are way out there too far. This one might be okay. So it's this hip. I've got it to get things to be even you just want to overlap it like that see without pushing it down you don't want to... but because we're going to cover with clothes I'm going to go now okay and I'm going to come back here in a second and I'm going to show you what's going to happen to us now okay I'll be back in a minute thank you for watching bye bye